Welcome to SecretComputerTips.com. In this tip, we're going to cover how to clean your PC of some of the trash that inevitably gets collected over a period of weeks, months, and years of usage. And to do so, we're going to use a tool called CCleaner. And if you've already got the guide, you can just um, go down a few pages to the link and that will take you directly to the download page. As it is, I've actually already downloaded the program, so I'm just going to open it up here. And I can see we're on the CCleaner application. And you'll notice here I have just about everything checked on the left side. Now I, I personally have left off these options here. Um, however, many people do like to delete everything and remember this is just old data or prefetch data you can see we've also got the recycle bin temporary files clipboard um, log files some of your recent documents and history and of course also our cookies and internet files so if if you if any of this stuff you don't want to del delete you can just uncheck it um, for most people they'd probably just want to clean everything so since everything's already checked we're just going to click over here and choose run cleaner and if you want to just see what it's going to delete you can click on analyze so let's go and do that first we'll click analyze and of course I run mine all the time but you can see we still have 10.4 meg in temporary internet files that's 1210 files so quite a bit of data and then if we want to clean that we just click on run cleaner and it'll go through and you see just like that it's deleted all of that data so that's the basic uh, way to use CCleaner one other thing I do want to share with you and it's under options is if you go to settings you'll see we have an option here to run CCleaner when the computer starts and if you click click that then um, every time that the PC comes on it's going to automatically run that by itself and so that's a pretty nice option for some and under advanced we have a few more options here of temp files and of course cookies is where we can set what cookies we want to be deleted and which ones we want to save many of you probably don't want to save any cookies but if there are some sites that maybe you you don't know your login information because it's stored in a cookie uh, you might want to keep those so that's basically it for ccleaner.com and again the ccleaner application is available from ccleaner.com and if you don't already have the guide it's called secret computer tips and it is available right now immediate download at www.secretcomputertips.com thanks again for joining us have a good one